While we want to appreciate also the fact that federal government has tried to incentivize some of the challenges, including the social uh, insurance cover and also review of some allowances, we urge states to follow suit. We want to applaud states like Sokoto and other labor-friendly states for setting the pace for granting some percentage increase in the hazard allowance payable to health workers in the state. But other states must go beyond lamentation to also try to appreciate those workers. Uh, because there is no gainsay to say that we are a very critical time and therefore globally these health workers are celebrated and also incentives given to them, including insurance cover, which the federal government have tried to lead. We wish to stress that such gesture should be equally bestowed on all health workers as members of one team fighting the deadly foe. Apart from the frontline health workers, especially the healthcare workers, millions of Nigerian workers are also fighting the COVID-19 battle from their homes. It is tough call adjusting to a new social regime of lockdown. Many workers are forced to telework from home using internet technology. We commend the compliance of workers and other Nigerians with the lockdown directive. That was a worthy contribution to fighting this pandemic. The coronavirus pandemic has raised a number of soft underbelly questions that we must confront as a nation and as a people going forward. Amidst the onslaught of the coronavirus, the doors raised by this pandemic has settled on the corrupt gate iron sheet of truth. How have we treated ourselves? How have we tested the weak and the vulnerable? How have we treated the weak and the most vulnerable? How has Nigeria treated her long-suffering workers? These are very pertinent questions that have been thrown up. It is on this note that we make the point that labor is not a commodity to be taken, trampled, and tossed aside. Workers create the wealth. It is not greed to demand a decent fraction of the reward of our effort. We urge workers everywhere to continue to draw inspiration from the fact that without our sweat, no sweet gain can be made. Without our witching of our muscles, no socioeconomic puzzle can be solved. Without our intuition, no initiative can be sustained. And without our dedication, no dividend can ever be declared.